Head of the Tobago Business Chamber, Martin George, is asking, where is the CEO of Caribbean Airlines? For years, Caribbean Airlines has been a profligate waster of the monies of Trinidad and Tobago. They have wasted our resources, wasted our time, wasted our efficiency. So therefore, we cannot continue this way if it is that we want to do better. And the government and the management of Caribbean Airlines have to take responsibility for this disaster which occurred. Mr. George said Caribbean Airlines fails to deliver on a consistent basis, and what occurred on Sunday was nothing short of a crying shame. So we call upon the government and the management of Caribbean Airlines to do better and make a change, otherwise you cannot continue doing the same things and expecting different results if you are doing them wrong or you are doing them ineffectively. It is quite a shameful scenario which occurred yesterday and we condemn it in the strongest possible way. George adds, with an increased airfare, Caribbean Airlines continues to show great inefficiencies. They've increased the airfare, right? It's gone from $300 to $400 and yet there's no increase in the efficiency, there's no increase in the effectiveness, in fact it seems to have gotten worse. He said, Kyle can't get a simple 15 minutes flight between Trinidad and Tobago right. We have seen for far too long these forays and flights of fancy by Caribbean Airlines, such as indicating they want to partner with Emirates Airlines, when in fact Emirates Airlines is light years ahead of Caribbean Airlines. Emirates Airlines is probably one of the you know, world's leading airlines. So you cannot be thinking of these things when you cannot even get a basic 15-minute flight between Trinidad and Tobago correct. Elizabeth Williams, TV6 News.